and welcome back to another one of my videos. Today I'm coming to you from the flight. We're travelling down to Melbourne with Bonza on their normal flight. It's going to be great. One of seven three seven max. So let's go do this. Let's go fly another Bonza. Let's do this. Be hard. And if you are travelling back with us to Melbourne, I've just arrived in on Bonza on their inaugural flight from Melbourne to Mackay. Thank you. And I'm now ready to head into the celebrations so I can prepare for the flight home back to Melbourne. Thank you. Welcome back on board the Bonza 737 MAX. Seats on this aircraft are laid out in a 3-3 configuration over 31 rows. And welcome to my seat for the 3 hour trek down to Melbourne. Today I am seated in seat 29A. Let's have a quick look at the seat features. There's USB power point there. That's the what you scan to get the menu. The tray table can be folded down from the seat in front and can be moved backwards and forwards. There's a little storage pouch there. That's where the safety car is meant to be, although for some reason my neighbour had two. The headrest can be fully adjusted like so. That'll be my view over to Melbourne today. Your pilots today, we are lucky enough to have two captains. We have Andrew and also Shane. 
Girl, hours and 46 minutes. My name is Polly, it's my pleasure to be a cabin supervisor. Please place your larger bags into your overhead lockers and the smaller bags underneath the seats in front of you. If you are seated in an exit row, all belongings need to be put into the overhead lockers for takeoff and landing. This is a non-smoking flight and the use of uh, smoking and the use of electronic cigarettes are not permitted at any time on this aircraft. If you haven't already, make sure you download the Fly Bonds app to order food, drinks directly to your seat during the flight. You'll also find some in-flight entertainment on the app. A team of Bonds of Legends are here to make your flight as awesome as possible. If you do need any help, just ask. Thank you once again and welcome aboard your Bonds of Flight to Melbourne. Kate and Alex, once again, my name is Polly. Four from the panel above you. To start the flow of oxygen, pull the mask firmly down towards you. Remove any mouth coverings and place the oxygen mask over your mask if necessary. For your own mask, before you assist children or others. If the mask does not inflate, don't worry, oxygen will flow so the exits are completely clear. The cabin is to be secured during takeoff landing whenever the seatbelt sign is on. Small electronic device up onto app. Take a look at the entertainment on Bonza. This was filmed in my previous flight up, but it's the same thing. So you scan the QR code on the back of the seat, then you enter your details in there. It will take you to a website with a live moving map, although sadly it wasn't too accurate on this flight. This is from the flight up from Melbourne to Mackay. There's also some menu. The menu sadly ran out about halfway through the flight though, which was really disappointing because I didn't even get a feed. All I got was a bottle of water. It contains alcoholic and non-alcoholic beverages as well. I went down and sat with my friend Hugo. He ordered a tea via the website. And I just decided to go with a simple bottle of water for today's flight. It was only $3, which is a really acceptable price on a plane. Seven three seven. 
Seven Max Lure review at the back of the plane coat hook there. It's relatively clean after doing it like high return, so pretty good. We're commencing our descent just a little over 10 minutes time. Weather conditions there, light winds, clear skies, and a very nice temperature of 7 degrees for you. We're going to be touching down just a little before 11 p.m. and we'll need to go a few minutes after that, so I'll be arriving a couple of minutes ahead of schedule. Thank this opportunity and thank you for choosing to fly with Monson. I appreciate having you on board. We uh, certainly hope you've enjoyed your time with us. Until we next meet, stay safe and bye for now making their way through the cabin for a final rush fish collection. If you have any unwanted items, please pass them to the crew as they make their way through the cabin. Surely the captain will switch on the fasten seatbelt sign in preparation for landing. Please make sure that your seat back is upright with your armrest down, your tray table is locked into position and your window blind is open. Please place your cabin baggage underneath the seat in front of you or into the overhead locker so that the aisles and exits are completely clear. You may continue to use large electronic devices including laptops until the seatbelt sign is switched on. Thank you. Seatbelt is firmly fastened. Large electronic devices including laptops must be switched off and put away. You may continue to use small electronic devices until we arrive at the gate, but all devices must be removed from the charging ports. Thank you. So as we begin to approach Melbourne, let's summarise yet another flight today on board Bonza. Wow, it was a Bonza experience. Even though this was just a regular night flight, I still enjoyed it a lot though. Let's start at Mackay Airport. I was quickly checked in. Sadly, no self-check-in there, so I had to use the just regular check-in desks. And I quickly made my way through security. That was a fast and efficient process as well. The celebration at Mackay was amazing. Free food, free drinks, and live entertainment. It was really enjoyable. I really enjoyed my time there and getting to meet a few people. It was then on to boarding. After getting screamed at with my friends on the tarmac for having our phones and cameras out, I boarded. I received a nice warm welcome back and was directed to my seat 29A for the full flight down to Melbourne. Takeoff out of Mackay was nice. Sadly, it was dark though, but I still do enjoy window seat on these flights. Disappointingly, they didn't have many options on the food-wise, and sadly they all got sold out really fast, which is a big disappointment, and something that I think that Bonza really needs to look at fixing as soon as possible. Other than that, I went down and sailed my friend Hugo, and we spoke about a few things and had a really enjoyable time there. That caused the flight to go extremely fast, so that was a great chat there. Other than that, it was just a regular flight really. Bonza is doing an amazing thing in the eyes of Australia, and I can't wait to see them expand and grow. Because trust me, they're a good airline, and you really should try and get on them when you do get a chance. A regular flight on this route will cost between $80 and $100. I was an invited guest on today's flight, but all opinions in this video are still my own. So, thank you very much for watching this video up until this point. I'm so grateful to have you still following along, and it means the world to me. If you don't want to miss out on more videos like this, including my European adventure, be sure to hit that like and subscribe button and turn that bell button on. Therefore, you'll be notified every time I upload and you'll be able to follow my journeys. Also, chuck a follow to my Instagram, iFlyAviation, where you can follow my journeys in real time and see where I am. Other than that, finally, if you do want to support me financially, it's available to be done so through either Patreon or PayPal me. Patreon is a monthly subscription and PayPal is for one of payments. Every single cent goes towards making my videos better and getting more of them done, so any amount is really appreciated. I'm so grateful for you still following along to this point. I hope you enjoy this scenic night approach into Melbourne and I'll see you all next week.
a welcome to Melbourne where the local time is 10.58. We would like to acknowledge the traditional owners of this land and pay our respects to the elders past, present and emerging. For your safety and the safety of those around you, please remain seated with the seatbelt fastened until the seatbelt sign has been switched off. If your mobile phone, phones are within reach, you are welcome to use this now. If you're leaving us via the tarmac, we ask that you that all electronic devices are not used until you enter the terminal. Before leaving, please check your seat for all personal belongings and be really careful when opening overhead lockers as items may have moved during our flight. When you leave the aircraft, please follow the directions of our ground crew. A reminder that smoking and the use of electronic cigarettes are not permitted on the tarmac or inside the terminal building. On behalf of our legends on board today, we would like to thank you for flying with Bonza and look forward to seeing you on board again soon. If Melbourne is home, welcome home. If you are visiting loved ones, enjoy special moments together. And if you're here for business, don't wait too hard. Thank you and have a great evening. Cabo Corey, this on those and cross check. That was my day on Bonza. I thought it was a Bonza adventure. I really liked it. You know, they're a good airline. It was a bit disappointing though that they ran out of snacks on that last flight. But um, yeah, obviously can't help it. In fact, they actually ran out of the snag in a bag halfway through the first flight, which is something I really wanted to try. Apart from that, great experience on them. Yeah, you know, much better than Virgin Australia or Jester for three hours, so. If you're gonna fly three hours, try and get on Monza. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this video. It's, I'm so grateful to have you still following along. If you like this video, make sure you hit that like and subscribe button. And I'll see you all next Friday, 4 p.m. Adelaide time for another video. See you all then.